まだ生きていますわかりました向かいます Let us try once more. You associates, who are they? How did you acquire fistful material? Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. <sighs> Which terrorist organization do you belong to? How did you acquire fistful material? <sighs> Hey, Gramps. I know you. Let's see. Jokes that's how I Hot damn. Done and gone. My husband died in that tower. But there are fates worse than death. I didn't want him to die. Naze Kono Yonakoto. Why did you do this? To bring an end to the madness you ピック。人は嘘つき。自分自身を欺く。だが、シャワチが。シャワ言うべんだが、彼らは決して嘘をつかない。死者の言葉には慎ましさがある。始めろ。And you, who are you?
Ugh, heavier than he looks. Now, listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So let's you and me figure this out. <laughs> Medical attention. Do you know a Reaper Doc whom you can trust? You. You were at Kumbeki Plaza. We must get to Reaper Doc. Quickly. Victor will fix us up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. All right, all right. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the service area. Just come pick me up. I need to get to Misty's Esoterica. Front of Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? Hey! 
The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear, though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neuro sockets between his lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit a vein by mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Let's get him inside. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! Pressure's tanking. It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of... I know what I'm doing. How is he? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. How you feeling? I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing. And I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of... hatred. Then I let it all out into a mic. And I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh. I plan a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. They killed me, Vic. Never been so afraid. It was too real, even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Saying I experienced another Psyche's memories? How's that possible? You two are connected in a way I can't make head or tail of. It's who? Me and who, Vic? <laughs> Who's the other? Johnny Silverhand, a terrorist. Real talk of the town back in my day. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. What is? The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much... life. A few weeks, tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness, gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. V, 
It's important you get all this. You'll fix me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would, V. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? I have to die. I am going to die. That's what you're saying. Prove it. Hmm. Dex shot you, right? The bullet damaged your chip slot and your brain. The biochip revived and short-circuited you. It started uploading data into your head. As far as it was concerned, your brain was an empty vessel that needed to be filled by the engram it was carrying. Empty vessel? But I'm right here. All of this is me! The shard doesn't read, it writes. Headache of yours? It's the biochip rewiring your neural pathways, building new neural structures, doing away with the old. From where the shard's sitting, you, what's left, is all a tumor that needs to be excised. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please, Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty? You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. And then he died. And I thought I was gonna die. With him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here. Got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudo-endotrizines from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. I gotta lie down. Here. Got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep? You're lovely, Misty. Thanks. Good night, V. Sweet, peaceful dreams. Get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Where'd you even come from? How are we even talking? 
How the fuck should I know? The fuck kind of droid toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! Who you work for, start talking! Fuck. Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait! You never, asshole. Now like that! Stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger! I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like mold on fruit, creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Kill you! Do it. What are you waiting for? Oh, fuck me. This has been your man, Stan! Join me for another day in our city of...